Remembering and revisiting. In this week's Telling Alaska Story, Arion Air Bureau introduces us to Rachel Mason, a key member who played an integral part of putting the lost villages of the Aleutians back on the map. I came here as a youthful adventurer in uh, 1981. Rachel Mason says that adventure landed her in Kodiak, where she thought she was going to work at a cannery and learn about the fishing industry. And I ended up driving a cab there for six years or, or so, which turned out to be good training for becoming an anthropologist. And she did. After graduate school, Mason returned back to Kodiak in 1989. I planned to work in, in different fisheries uh, to, to, to study the occupational identity of commercial fishermen. Unfortunately, the Exxon Valdez oil spill happened in March 1989. As unfortunate as it was for the fishing industry, Mason says it gave her and other scientists the opportunity to work on several impact studies. Now she's working what she calls her dream job as a cultural anthropologist at the National Park Service. I've gotten involved in a lot of historical projects that that I think I've been able to bring my skills as an anthropologist to them. One being the Lost Villages Project, villages left behind during World War II. The tech club will take four former residents and five descendants of residents to revisit McCushin. By working with the people that were still around and, and talking to living people, I think that brings a, 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 another perspective onto history. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord. Through her many projects, Mason enjoys empowering others to learn about and tell their own stories. If I, I show a picture and somebody says, that's my mom, and, and, and people realize what their, their connections are to, to the villages that they, their ancestors left behind long ago, or that they're, they're, they're finding out more about, about their history, and that, that's the, the real pride that I take in it. A pride the Alaska Historical Society's recognized over the years. This yeah. one I got uh, in 2012. Her awards sit in her that office next to this photo, taken in 2010 on a career. visit to one of the lost villages. She was just overwhelmed with the, the opportunity to, to go back to the, the village where her grandparents were from. And on that trip, Mason was overjoyed to be able to bring that experience to her. This was one of the happy moments of my, yeah. my career. A career she's happy to do each and every day. For Telling Alaska's Story, Arianne Aaron Bureau, Alaska's News Source.